Okay, guys, here we go. We're into another product review today. Now, before I say anything, check your state regulations to make sure these knives are legal in your state. Now, if they aren't, I can't tell you what you can and what you can't do. Now, these knives. Switchblade. These are very nice knives I bought. I had thought I was going to get scammed, and I did on two of them. Two of them I thought were metal, and they weren't. So, I'll be going over pricing and quality and everything in the videos. I use these knives on a daily day basis now. So, I just want to say, make sure you check the state resolution. I know my state, they're legal in, because I do not have the uh, certain brand. There's a certain brand that is illegal. You'll see it in the movie It, where you can go through the guy's neck. Um, so, that brand is illegal. I do not have any of those. I will, I will never get one of those, because those are dangerous. Um, so, I hope you guys enjoy the video. And let's get into it. Swag, bitch. So, I have a few knives I have to go over. First, we're going to start with the cheapest to most expensive. These guys. Plastic. Weak spring. Strong spring. You can hear how one has more force than the other. They are both very sharp. I can cut with them. Uh, this one's made by Holly Edge. So, I haven't, I've heard good things about Holly Edge, but I'm not too sure about them. So, that's these two. These plastic ones. Now, I have two mini metal guys. Now, these are heavy. But the weight is different on both of them. But there is no sound difference in springs. So as you can see, I have two different types here. I have one sharp blade that I use for cutting boxes at work and stuff. Which is very nice. It's very sharp. I mean, cuts rope, no problem. This one, I have not used yet. I just like it for the look of it. As you can see, it has the jaggers on it. So, it looks very interesting. Now, the first ones were like 4 to $5. These were like 7 to 9 And then, this one is... I think it's Bench Blade. Bench... Bench Aid. Bench Blade, Bench Aid. So, um, this one, however... You can tell it's a powerful knife. Now, yes, it's a fake carbon fiber wrap, but you can listen to it all day, and it sounds like it's badass. Now, this one is my most favorite knife. I have not had no problems with these knives. I've used them for the last four to five weeks, switching in and out of each one. I usually carry a knife on me because you never know when something might happen. Um, yeah, some switch blades are illegal in some states, and, um, my state, they're legal, but there's a certain brand that's illegal. It's the brand that they use in it, the new one, the remake, where the kid goes up to his father and goes like this to his neck and goes like that. Now, you can't put this through somebody's neck. I would demonstrate, but I don't feel like having a little hole in my neck. Because this is very fucking sharp. Now, they're very sharp on the basis of that. Which I like, because you can cut through paper, or you can cut something out. Like if you're drawing a shape, I usually go like that, and then flip it around and cut something out. Because that's why I like the pointed ones for. You can cut shapes out of paper. Or if you need to, just you can fold and do something cool or make yourself a little mask, which is funny. Um, but yeah. That's my basis of what I like about my knives. Now, they are very good. I know they are wish quality bought. The plastic ones I thought were metal. They said they were metal. Well, I got ripped off by that one. So, but not my watch. This is the first time that wish has ripped me off. So, 
you'll see hopefully in the next video or whatever. I'll probably have a few slow mo shots of these knives going in and out. So stay tuned. Tell me that you love me, even if it's